Hi, my name is Christian Thibodeau. I'm a world-class strength coach. I've been training athletes for over 25 years in over 26 different sports, ranging from grade school all the way to professional level. Today, I want to give you my honest review on the Rogue KS Squat Stand, so a kid's squat stand, the Uso Mini Barbell, which is designed specifically for very young kid, as well as the Rogue Technique Bumpers that you can use with uh, those barbells. First, I actually bought this equipment out of my own pocket. It's not a sponsorship or anything, simply because my kid trains. He's five years old and he's already doing the squats, the bench press or the full press, overhead press, clean snatches, deadlifts, curls, because you need big biceps, right? And I was kind of tired to always load the bar on his shoulder for squats, okay? Because it's either that or he was limited to what he could power clean to do the front squats. So when we got the rack, it actually immediately increased his performance just because he could actually unrack and rack his own bar. It makes him a lot more confident than just me bringing the bar up to him. And at the end of the set, he has to wait there for me to bring the bar down. So the squat, much better. He also enjoyed that a lot more because he feels like he's one of the real guys, like one of the hardcore guys, one of the serious lifters, right? Now, the rack is very solid. Uh, it's the same material as all the other adult rogue stands and rigs so it's quality made the j hooks here have a nice plastic insert so it will not scratch your bar that's pretty cool and also it's very narrow it's literally only 32 inches wide but my wife always reminds me that i buy way too much training stuff because we have like a garage gym and there's no more room there's no more room where will you put the rack well you know what that rack fits pretty much anywhere you could put it in your closet if you wanted to okay it's a, it's very nice it's 32 inches wide and deep so it doesn't require much space which is very cool it's pretty light i had to move it to the gym super easy to do now as far as the bar is concerned what we have is the oso mini bar this bar is basically specifically designed for very young kids. Rogue has a very wide range of bars, uh, ranging from the Oso Mini, which is the kid bar, uh, all the way up to the adults bar, but they also have the Technique bars, which I also got, but they are the same size as a regular barbell, just with a smaller gripping and is much lighter because it's made of aluminum. So it's not really adequate for a kid uh, of Jaden's age, which is five, because it's way too long and a kid who's like this high with a bar that's six feet long or seven feet long, it's kind of hard to control the movement because the longer the bar is, the more unbalanced it becomes and it, it just creates a lever that makes it more unstable. So that bar is perfect for a kid his age. Also cool is that the width of the grip is very, very small. That's the neglected factor. Yeah, it's cool to have a bar that weighs less for your kids, but also you need to understand that they have smaller hands. And if you grip a normal bar, they will be limited by their grip strength. You want to have a normal feel. That bar in the hand of a kid will feel the same as an adult bar in an adult's hand. So that's very, very cool also for that. The knurling is good. It's not too aggressive, but it's, it won't slip out of their hands. It has nice bearing, so it rolls pretty well which is also very important if you're introducing your kids to the Olympic lifts. The worst thing is to do power cleans or even power snatches with a bar that doesn't rotate properly. It's gonna mess up your wrists or even your elbows. So that's also a big bonus. All in all, I really like that bar. The only downside I can say is that the sleeve is a bit too short. That's like five inches and a regular sleeve is something like 12 inches. Now that's not necessarily a big issue because you can use a decent amount of small bumper plates. You can use a decent amount of uh, normal plates. When it becomes limiting is when you're using the Technique bumpers, which I love because it's the same size as a regular plate. So when you do deadlift or cleans or whatever, you can actually start the bar at the same position as you would with a normal barbell, but it's lighter. The problem is, if I'm putting it on the sleeve here, I barely have enough room to attach a collar. I cannot add any more weight here, okay? Now, that's not a big issue until your kid becomes strong enough to lift more than five pounds per size. For example, uh, Jaden can, can clean 15 pounds per size plus the weight of the barbell. So if he does his warm up with five, the next step is stems per side. That's too big of a jump for a kid. That's like adding 25% of your load on a set. So that's the one downside. Now understand the bumper plate, the Technique bumper is designed mostly for their Technique bars, which are very good for a kid of let's say 12 
to 15 years of age who wants to do the Olympic lifts or, or regular strength training because it's a regular size bar with a regular size sleeve. But if you want to use it with the Oslo mini bar, it's going to limit you. So you might need to go with uh, like a wooden option or something like that. But overall, I would say that I'm very pleased with the equipment. If you are the father or the mother of a kid and you want to introduce them to weight training, certainly this is a very, very versatile tool, very good bar, I highly recommend it.